Hey YouTube, this is Random Nation, and this is Hell's Gate, also known as Hell's Gate Bridge. Right behind me, about 10 feet, is the main part of the bridge. You're actually, right now, we're actually standing on the bridge. Now let me give you a little bit of backstory on this bridge. I actually had to look it up just so I could make sure I got it right. But back in the 50s, a young couple was driving down this road that this bridge used to be on. They hit a wet spot in the road, and they went off the bridge, and they both died in the car. It was almost three weeks later when somebody actually found their bodies and pulled them out of the water. Now, right back here, you, we used to be able to drive up and down this bridge, but of course they've shut it down, as you can tell how grown up it is behind me. Um, but used to, you could park your car in the middle of this bridge, turn off your car, and you could look in your rear view mirror, look behind you, and you could see what they call a little like hell behind you. My personal belief on that one, I believe they're seeing their own tail lights just reflecting funny behind them. But there is another part of this story. Also, you would have the back seat of your car would end up getting wet. Now, this is my first time really getting a chance to walk on the bridge. I have been down here a couple of times. One time I recorded before, and the video quality just wasn't that good, so I didn't post it because I didn't want y'all to just kind of look at it like, wow, what is this? All right. But I don't know if y'all can see this. I'm going to try to show y'all. This is what the bridge looks like during the daytime. Okay. I got it. That's what the bridge looks like during the daytime. Of course, it has grown up more since this picture was taken. I'm going to try to walk a little way out here. They prefer for people not to come out here because they say it's not safe. I uh, am stupid, so I'm going to come out here. Ooh, it's kind of soft spot. Let me slide over a bit. Alright. Another soft spot right there, too. Alright. I'm trying to be careful. I'm going to have Amy stay right there because I don't want her to come onto the bridge if it does decide to collapse on it for anything. But I'm going to turn my phone's sound recorder, if I can find it. I'm going to turn my sound recorder on and I'm going to do an EVP session. EVP session basically means an electro, uh, electronic voice phenomenon. Okay? I'm going to ask some questions, and then later I'm going to go back and listen to it, and if I hear anything, I'm going to put it in a second video for y'all to actually hear it. Is there anyone out here? Kevin. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Sorry, I had to stop for a second because Amy had something going on with her phone. I'm going to go a little bit further this time. I keep feeling stuff to touch me. I don't know if that's uh, normal or what. I'm holding on to this metal rail over here on the side. That way it's even happy about this. Grab a hole so it's turn the water below. Now, I don't know if y'all can still see me, but this point right here, Coming back that way. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Alright, yeah. I, I just literally watched a person walk onto the bridge right in front of me and disappear. <laughs> Alright, guys, well, we're going to finish up an <laughs> EPT and uh, I'm going to cut the film here. The part where I was at the was the center of the bridge, and there's that section of the bridge that's missing where the car actually crashed at. And. Apparently they didn't like me being there because they walked literally about five feet from me and then just disappeared right in front of me. So yeah, I think we're done for tonight. I know a lot of you are going to say that I'm a coward and I got scared, but hey, guess what? You ain't out here. I am. So I'm heading back this way.